Good morning students. In the last video, we have done states of matter, solute, solvent and solution, soluble impurities and insoluble impurities. This time, we will do question answers. Take all your copies, write on date, lesson number 8, materials and solutions. Part 4, first question, distinguish between soluble and insoluble substances. Answer, soluble substances. Students, substances that dissolve in water are called soluble substances. For example, salt, sugar. Understood? Substances that dissolve in water are called soluble substances. For example, salt, sugar. Leave one line, write down insoluble substances. Substances that do not dissolve in water are called insoluble substances. For example, oil, sand. Leave a line. Write on second question. How can soluble impurities present in water be removed? Answer by boiling, adding chemicals like chlorine, etc. All have written students. Next, write on third question. How can insoluble impurities present in water be removed? Number 1. By sedimentation. Number 2. By decantation. Number 3. By filtration. Number 1. By sedimentation. By decantation. Number 3. By filtration. Leave a line. Fourth question. Explain what is a solution. Give an example. What is a solution? Answer, the liquid that is obtained when a solute dissolves in a solvent is called a solution. What is solution? The liquid that is obtained when a solute dissolves in a solvent is called a solution. Solute plus solvent is equal to solution. Salt plus water is equal to salt solution. Leave one line. Fifth question. What is filtration? What is filtration? Answer. Filtration is a process of removing insoluble impurities present in water. What is filtration? It is a process of removing insoluble impurities present in water. All have written. Leave one line. Sixth question. Define the terms. Melting, freezing, matter, molecules. Answer. Number one, melting. What is melting? The process of changing a solid to liquid on heating. The process of changing a solid to liquid on heating. Leave one line. Number two, freezing. Underline the process by which a liquid turns to solid. When liquid turns to solid, it is called freezing. Underline number three, matter. Anything that occupies space or has weight. What is matter? Anything that occupies space or has weight. Leave one line. Number four, molecules, tiny particles that make up matter. What are molecules? Tiny particles that make up matter. All have written. Leave one line, seventh question. How can you get salt from a salt solution? Answer, by using evaporation method. All have written students. Very nice. Okay, advice for two minutes. Next page, write on hots. Write on hots on the next page. Number one question. Rahul wants to dissolve bond vita in a glass of milk. Should he put it in hot or cold milk? Answer. He should put it in hot milk. He should put it in hot milk. Downwards write down learn lesson 8 for test. Next week I will take test of lesson number 8. Ok students understood? I hope my little ones have followed quickly what I taught to you. 
Dear students, please don't go outside. You all are so good. You will obey your parents. Stay home, stay healthy and stay happy. Thank you students. Thank you students. Thank you.